That is stunning. Nice, isn't it? Oh, wow. I actually wasn't expecting it to be like this. And I've watched all the videos. Yeah, yeah, she knew exactly what she was coming for. Yeah, I did not. Oh, well, I didn't because that. Wow. You just keep watching the track. I'll enjoy the view. Okay. <laughs> What's that? I think we're going the wrong way. I think we're going the wrong way? Nope. We're going downhill, but it feels like we're getting pushed backwards. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Little seat hot there. Definitely not a day that we can pop the drone up. No, it might be a bit blustery for the <laughs> drone. Oh, little puddle. I'm not going to enjoy doing this gate. <laughs> you know what's going to happen, don't you? No, I reckon we're good. <laughs> that one's like... Behind the back. Hey? Eh? Got the skills. <laughs> All good, eh? <sighs> Alright, when you're ready. What's that? Like four that's or five? Four, that's four. Four. <sighs> I was going to say, I think you've been giving me a bum steer about the 20 plus gates <laughs> obviously they're all on this side I couldn't get that lucky. This one gets points. Looks good, this one. Reasonably flat. Yeah. Oh. Looks like it probably swings either way too, does it? No, not in that wind. That'll be. take off from here. Um, yeah okay? Is it too yeah. high on the other side? No. Just checking. Oh. oh. Good? Yep. Oh. Oh. Go before that next wind gust comes yeah. through. Yeah. <laughs> down there. 
then we'd have to get back out. Yeah. Almost a warm enough day, if it wasn't for that wind, that I'd be tempted to take my shoes off. Test the water. Test the water, you reckon? Yep. But you know, there's a wind, so. <laughs> Photo. Gate photo. <laughs> are, are you good waiting there for a minute? Yeah. Well, oh, you're stopping. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> She's a bit blustery here. <laughs> Just all of a sudden. Oh my god. Oh. Go, go the other way, maybe. Yeah. Mm. She's got no bottom hinge, this one. No. That'll do, that'll do. That enough? Yeah. It's fine going back, the wind takes it. Okay, still there, still smiling. <laughs> Who needs a gate dance? You just got to be able to stand up. Other way, whoa, down she goes. <laughs> Man down, what happened there? There's no bottom oh, hinge. Hang on, I'll have a look up and give you a hand. Oh. <laughs> Got to come back this way with it anyhow. I was following the drag mark and it's right off the bottom hinge. Just... You come back this way with it. Might be able to put that back in, hang on. You'd have to lift that end of it. A bit more. Uh, come swing it back towards me. Keep going, keep going. Come back this way further. It might stay in there. Just, just lift the weight on it, that's all. Oh. <laughs> well, the bike's not fallen over, I've not fallen over, but the passenger has. Uh, good to have you along for the entertainment. <laughs> Did it stay in there? Yeah. Now, the serious question, did you hurt yourself? No idea. <laughs> uh. See, there's a drag mark that way. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. So no. I was like, oh, yeah, just, and it literally just... <laughs> just crumpled. <sighs> When you're ready. You're welcome. Oh. Oh. 
I don't think we should take the chicken track. Oh, really? After I just wiped out on a gate, you want yeah, to take a, a chance? Bit. I want to take... <laughs> this is the track. This one here doesn't look much better. We're down to a one, so you know. We're down, we're down to a one on the gates. Yeah. Oh, no. Nice. Yeah, I'll just stop there for you. Yep. Ah, Santana Minerals, Indigo Ofa Gold project. Well, you did say you thought that was happening. Yes. How the hell? Yeah, I reckon that'll go up this way, eh? Kinda. Oh yeah, there we go. Might see, stop up here at the old hut, eh? Yeah. See, the problem is, all these people come through here who don't have the experience that I do. <laughs> and they don't understand how gates work. No. <laughs> <laughs> such a thing. But, oh my god, look at him. He's just staying in out of the weather. Can you? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, nah, he's away. <sighs> he's not going far though. <laughs> Uh, cool. Huh. All right. Good. Too, oh. windy for, too windy for him to go too far. Yeah. Well, he was. He was. Oh, sorry. He um wasn't in a particular hurry heading down there. No. Now I know why. Look, he's still just sat like he's stopped at the next bush. So I wish you bastard stop looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> Cheeky little look. Nah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I didn't even see him. No, I didn't see that one. <laughs> uh. Probably just woke him up from his afternoon nap. Yeah, how rude. <laughs> View from this side, eh? Yeah. You good? Yep. Just be careful. These gates bite. <laughs> this one's likely to push you. The wind will push you straight through.
It's still windy. I hadn't noticed. <laughs> Trap climbing away up the top, mm. and he says that's where we're going. <laughs> wow, what a stunning view out this side! These valleys, you just don't get tired of coming, no, coming, coming over the hill and the valley opening up. Yeah. Mount, is it that's the Bendigo? Ah, uh, yeah. Mount something track. It's been shot to pieces. Yeah. Insert name here. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I need to go any higher up there today. Get fully blown off the side of the hill. Yeah. Might not end well. We might do that one next time we're through. This one looks like about a four, I reckon. <laughs> it could only be up from the debacle that was the one. <laughs> but, now, but, but, but to be to be fair, was that the gate's fault or was that was that the person opening its fault? It was the gate's fault. The gate was broken. <laughs> Not my fault. It was off its hinges. Well, you probably, you know. Did you do your safety checks first and check that the hinges were in good order oh, before you tried to open the door? Stop key? it. <laughs> um. What was that latch to? Just that. Yep. I'll give you safety checks. <laughs> like that road might be for up in the mining part there, eh? Hmm. Well, there's actually like a sluice and stuff, like a, a pump just there. Oh, is there? On the flat. Oh, just a pump. Something. Just a pump. Yeah. And there's a pad. They've obviously been pumping water for something. 
pumping something. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, I say. Yeah. Uh, the time I come through, that had like water in it. It was full. Oh, really? drilling and, and yep. stuff, yeah. Ah, oh, there's a bit of machinery on the other side there. Ah, oh, yeah, drilling. Yep. So there is possibly still gold in these hills. Yeah. Probably quite a lot still. <laughs> yeah, that would just be. Might just stay on this side. Fun enough coming up. Oh, I got an open gate. Woo! <laughs> How many have you done? About nine? Yeah, I think so. Not bad. Nine, probably had what, two or three open? Yep. I think overall it was still me over the gates, but that one got me good. Yeah. There you go, stand for battery. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, here's the actual bind shaft. Oh, you're right at it, are you? Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, they did say that it was right there. Sixty meters. Yeah, right. Should we get the torch? Oh yeah, she's a bit of a walk down to the stamper. Yeah. Can just see it from here. Jeez, they put some stuff in some you know. I had to cart all that stuff in here, eh? Well, he was on a delivery run from Bannockburn and discovered the gold reef in 1880. Yep. Um, and then he went into business, but before the operations got underway, he actually sold his shares and went farming at Terrace, and that family still farms there. Um, first crushing of 350 tonne, they yielded 110 ounces. Whew, that's pretty good. No. 3.42 kilos and the second was as disappointing by 1881 they closed her up again yeah right and then they reopened it in 1908 but overall it didn't yield enough so they abandoned it in the 20s hmm. there you go cool landscape across the edge of the hill eh? it is a little um mesa or Plateau. Yeah, you really can't sink back up into that either. No, you can't. Well, it's 
every bit as good a day over this side as it was over the other. It is. Apart from the wind. Yep. But Alley we're going to head to uh, Cromwell, so it's going to push us down the lake with a bit of luck. <laughs> Yeah, hopefully it is blowing the right way for that. Sort of seems to be. Yeah. This one just looks nasty. Hang on. I don't have all my cameras on for you. Good. <laughs> yeah. What, so you can like capture my glorious wipeout again? No, no, one for the day is fine. More than enough. Ah, uh, you, what the hell? <laughs> People don't do the gates up so tight, the next person has to be able to get it open. Did you see any wallabies? Nope. Ah, oh, that's good. arrangement. through at a good time. Yeah, we missed all of them. That's good. Yep. Well, just coming out the bottom here now, back down to the sealed road. That's another uh, another one ticked off the list, eh? Yes. Yep. I, yeah, it wasn't as bad for as many gates as I thought, so I'm glad we did it. Yeah, yeah. Perfect day. Yeah, no, wow, well, apart from the wind, it's a bit windy, but visually it's a perfect day. Yes. You, you probably couldn't get a better visual day for it. Mm. Clear as. Based on that, I think we'll call that the day, eh? Yep. Just a road ride from here. Pretty much a road ride from here, yeah. Yeah. So we'll um, see what tomorrow brings, eh? Yeah. Last, whether we, whether we last do day, if last, we do something. Last day for us to actually do something. So we'll, um, yeah, we've got something in mind, but we'll see how it goes. So we might see you tomorrow. Over and out. Bye. Sad face. Today's our last, I guess, touring day. Uh, from Ettrick, like all good adventure riders, we decided why take the main road. So we came back up the other side of the river and angled our way again from Alex and came out through here to the lower Manaburn and then up to Omakau. And then we actually angled across through here somewhere through Thompson's Gorge and then back down from Terrace back into Cromwell, uh, hoping for one more day on the bike.